Every morning it's literally the same thing Searching for school shoes Where is it? Why did they just like get feet and hide away? Don't mind how messy the stuff here is, ne? So this one, it's this one, got it I'm asking if it's this one because I have Ooh, I have two pieces of school shoes One is like broken and this is like the right one So let me put this one <laughs> Does my hair look fine? Because like, I was thinking I should redo it, but I don't know if I have time because I need to be at school for a meeting. Does it look fine? I hope it does. If people say my hair doesn't look nice, um, it's Monday. It's literally Monday morning. Sorry. Okay, so today, first things first, on the agenda, I have a meeting at 7 o'clock. Then, I need to take pictures of people for something I did yes then I'm gonna go say happy birthday to my favorite teacher I have a gift over there I'm just gonna go give it to her yeah coming now does my hair look fine? that looks nice it's beautiful I was worried that I might have to redo it Yeah, I'm ready to go. I think I'm just waiting for my mom for something. Yeah, so. Yeah. I have so much energy today, I don't know why. Just finished all my morning things. I had to drop keychains also at our deputy principal now. We're gonna see for a teacher. Okay. So we're in Ello right now. We're just getting some more. Guys, we're literally in Matrik and Mans is using a tiny tube. But explain yourself. <laughs> explain yourself. Explain yourself. Is this? I did, we didn't work in grade 10, remember? So I just found the book and I was like, hey. This is the this is the Matrix. So right now I'm in the bathroom of our activity center because we're busy setting up for the good eight place the ceremony that's taking place tomorrow. Yeah, so that's where we are right now. That means I'm missing out on three periods. So I'm missing out on English and then a double business period. So that means I need to catch up on all at work. <laughs> but that's fine. It's just a part of the job, I guess. Yeah, so let me show you what's happening outside. Yeah. Can you move it a little bit more to the side? Like that way. That's what we did. We must just pull it tighter. So pull it more out. There we go. Okay, move it to so now move it a bit more. That way. There we go. That's perfect. Yeah. Things got tough again. So I forgot to vlog. Didn't even eat yet today. It's probably like already one o'clock. It's break. I'm probably not gonna eat um again. So I'm gonna shove something in my mouth just now I don't actually eat today. And then I'm hungry all period because I saw a Maxim cat today. A good eight. Bought me a power aid. You just gave me a power aid, guys. The whale almost cried. The whale almost cried because I needed that power aid. The amount of stress I was going to go through. Basically, I wrote an account in Baseline yesterday. And I didn't have my calculator. And now I thought I lost my calculator. But it's at home, which is where I am at right now. And I found it. I genuinely thought I lost it. And I was literally going to scream. Because my day has been rough, to say the least. It's, it's been rough. I'm not going to go into detail about why it's rough, but it's just... Shit happens, you know. Things happen, and that's life. And things just happen to happen. And then I just... I feel up because, like, it's something that's been growing, and then it finally just... Good morning, guys. So, it is Tuesday, day two of the week. Um, and I need to be at school early again because I have some things that I need to sort out. So, I'm going to take you guys with me. I'm looking for my watch. That's what I'm looking for. And I must get my lunch. She And my glasses. And this is also got my glasses. I should be blind over there. Um, I'm going to show you guys today's outfit. Hold on. So can you like stay? Pullover 
my bag. Um, it's literally way too hard to be wearing my blazer. Like, I'm not about to suffer in this heat. And tonight I'm wearing it again because I have to be here at school tonight. <laughs> I have some speeches that I need to do. If I forget to vlog again, it's because my day was hectic again. Like, here I've been having so many hectic days and I don't know what's going on. But hopefully today's gonna be a better day because I done some worship in the shower. If you guys wanna do something, if you wanna like get close to God, worship in the shower. Because sometimes I forget to worship. So I thought, why don't I just add it in the morning routine? I arrived at school like 11 minutes ago. Um, I was doing some work now. So, yeah. It's short for the job. <laughs> okay, so for some bread, yo, bread, yo, yo, take two. For some background context, the RTL like it was in charge of Rock and Week. So, I was taking the school song, and this is me listening to something new right for the Blazers. Yeah. Basically, now Tino doesn't. I don't know why, but he doesn't want to say hi to you guys. It's shy. Didn't he say your videos blow up when he's, on the when he's, on, when he's in the video? It blows up a bit. Can you just comment that you're here for me? You're here for me yes. now. You're here for me. You're not here for Tino. Like, but you're also here for Tino. So I, I the like algorithm that yeah. goes like this and I'm no. But will you in the thumbnail? <laughs> <laughs> So guys, let me, if you guys are new to the channel, this is Nambu and that is Tino. Say hello. <laughs> so, initially we were called the coffee corner last year, but then we got split up. Now we're only three. We're only three. The other two are somewhere else. Yeah. At so, least I have a tour together. Yeah. So we have Edmund right now and then we're going to our first period which is business. <laughs> it has an ink on so I'm like really happy about that. No sir. Yo! <laughs> so basically I'm stuck with this really nice bit of a picture on but now she changed it to not at all. Hey, we'll pass it. And now she doesn't have the picture. So look at me, I'm like, I could be. Like, you know what you're doing? You know what you're doing? <laughs> and I don't! <laughs> okay, to be honest, it was me who put a name on our phone. <laughs> it is so crazy! <laughs> so this grade 8 bought me a power 8 again. Guys, damn. Say hi! <laughs> okay, we will do that. Thank you so much. Thank you, bye. Bye. It's literally late for maths. Because I had to call the courier company because the package is coming that we need for the exit money. And we are stressing that we weren't gonna get it. So I had to call, find out if it's coming. They said it's coming. So now it's cooking my bag so I can go to math for now. So, a lot's going on. Just hope we didn't do too much work while I was gone. I was gone for maybe 10 minutes. Shit, we done a lot of work. So, this week we actually done school work. So, this is just like a clip of me working. But I didn't record in other classes because I don't want to always record me working. So, I'm on my way at home right now. When I get home, I'm going to make some lunch. Take a time for like 15 minutes. I don't know. Then I need to go back to school. I arrived at school. So today I'm basically doing a speech by the grade 8 ceremony. The speech is in here. It's in two languages, so I packed it in and I had to type an Afrikaans spot when I got home. I didn't take a nap. So hi, yeah, we have Mila. 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 Mila Gray. Yeah, she's, she's a celeb right now. She's like an actual celeb. That's, name. That's her name. Yeah. Say my name, say my name, say my name. <laughs> when no one is. Baby, I love my name. The 
subject of an army was purposefully chosen to represent the power that results from unity. Ek bid dat die verbindings wat jy hier maak nooit sal breek nie en dat jy altyd die waarde van eenheid sal onthou in alles wat jy doen. Thank you for starting this amazing journey with us as the RCL of 2024 and I hope you succeed as a newly recruited Kaylee. We just finished the evening. Yeah, we all sorted. Now we're going home. We're getting a snack or two. Inga, you look so stressed. What bucky is it? I didn't realize how important it was to start your day off on a good note until I literally started to listen to worship music every morning. Guys, tell me why my days have just been like, yes, it's my day. So, like, obviously, I'm doing a little work. But other than that, it's like I'm enjoying the day, I have energy. You know, I like really, I'm like so tired that I've come home and I take a nap. Lately, I have energy to come home, eat, and then I go straight into my work. Damn. I'm proud of myself, guys. Like, okay, so today I'm just wearing a white shirt with my skirt. So then I got to school, obviously, and then I started doing work because we had all our subjects and everything. So I was just summarizing in my one class and yeah, so this is just like some snippets of me actually doing work. Guys, so tomorrow we have our inter-house athletics and this girl wants to bring a whole ass gazebo. I will leave it there in the morning and then I'll go and then I'll go. People, so people are gonna use your gazebo and you're gonna say no leave they're gonna think that it's a school's gazebo but it's your gazebo it's for like and all then, the parents most exactly the parents. and then now you're gonna unpack it again and then you're gonna carry it to the car that is parked outside of the school okay okay i didn't think this one through exactly yeah. um so shouldn't i probably put this camera down because it's like kind of bothering me that I need to hold it all time. But then again, if I put it here, you guys are gonna literally see the view of my bed and you guys have seen my bed like twice. Okay, let's go to the kitchen. My mom is out here, so I can talk as loud as I want. Okay, so we're in my kitchen. As I said, don't mind that my top is on the wrong way around. Please don't mind that. But this is what I need to say. Um, so the cat's out of the bag. For many of you don't, that don't know what the cat is that is in the bag um it's the fact that i'm the rcl chairperson for 2024 yeah so i found out last year that i got um elected for that and i didn't want to mention it but since i'm doing school vlogs it got mentioned and you're probably wondering, like, Mila Gray, we literally loyal subscribers, and you didn't let us know this important information. Let me just say important. So, the reason why I didn't want to say anything is because it's. I don't want. <laughs> Why does, it, why does it sound like this is going to get serious? My thing is, no. Once people realize that you have a title, what they end up doing is they literally end up mentioning that you have a title the whole time. And I don't like that. So, for example, if I do something, they're going to say, oh, da 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 And I don't necessarily like that, especially in the sense where I'm not doing anything school related. Like, if I'm talking to someone and they're like, oh, how are you doing in school? I'll be like, oh, I'm doing good. Like, I'm not going to elaborate and say what I'm doing good in. Because that's just the type of person I am. 
but I just don't think, like personally, I didn't think that that um, is an important piece of information. And I know that kind of pisses people off because it sounds like I'm bragging when I'm not. I just don't think that a title is something that is necessarily... The title doesn't define me and that's why I don't feel the need to share this. But I'm sharing it since you guys found out because I done a speech at the Great Egg Blaze ceremony. And yeah. And you guys will only see this goofy side of me. So I just wanted to show you guys that I am also kind of like a like a, a calm serious person <laughs> sometimes. <laughs> but yeah. This was hard to say. So upload me in the comments down below. I wanna see clapping emojis at the bottom because I'm really bad at communicating. And this is the first time that I'm speaking my honest feelings out and another reason why i didn't want to bring it up is because the majority of my subscribers go to my school so they really know <laughs> but there's also a lot of people that aren't in my school that yeah so you guys don't know but now you know and please don't use my title against me because some people do that and i don't like it so where are we gonna sit Let, let's find a nice spot to sit and then we, i'm just gonna yap with you guys because i'm in a yapping mood this happens when I'm happy, I don't know why. I'm gonna put you guys here and I'm gonna be on a couch. Okay, I'm gonna cook. I'm gonna cook. Let me cook, let me cook, let me cook. Did I cook? Did I not cook? If someone comments I burnt the <laughs> I burnt the pot. Okay, um you like in my way. They can't see my face. Okay. Um so basically today we had athletics at our school, like the inter house sis thing got and i'm javelin and then the most embarrassing thing happened okay imagine this i me ick right i'm doing javelin i mind you i've never done javelin before never in my life okay remember that this is key to the story okay so I'm going and I'm like, I'm here to do javelin. <laughs> okay. At least I said I'm doing it for fun. Then I took the stick. Okay. Then I'm getting ready to throw. I'm getting ready. I'm getting ready. I throw. You know what happens? The javelin stick hits my head. Most embarrassing thing ever most <laughs> and then all the teachers laughed i was often worth by the way because like that was very embarrassing just imagine someone throwing ne? imagine it the stick throwing imagine it and then wah. um yeah so that's the end of the video i hope you guys enjoyed and uh, i'll see you guys next week Guys, my is actually getting serious now, no? The first week was a breeze and now it's not a breeze anymore. Because I'm writing a math class on Monday. Nothing's funny anymore. Nothing is funny anymore. <laughs>